我想不管结果如何，我们将都将欣赏到一套高水平的、精彩的世界级的这个动作。董震是从旋锤开始，好的，很轻松的压上，成一个十角支撑，再做一个水平十字，倒十字支撑，非常到位，非常平啊。再是一个倒十字，又是个零点，零点一，十字水平，非常平。阿扎良又是一个地组，零点五的加分。非常稳啊！大回环纹丝不动。董震下法是直接。Je ne vois pas qui pourrait l'inquiéter. À peut-être Ivan Ivankov qui est aussi très puissant, mais qui manque peut-être de netteté dans l'exercice de finition. Mais Yuri a installé sa notoriété depuis très longtemps et il sera très très difficile à battre une fois de plus. Ici, planche libre, avion, temps de ventre. Planche libre, encore temps de ventre. Non. Il remonte jusqu'à l'équilibre, ce qui augmente la difficulté. Croix de fer renversé. Remonté. Grand tour en lune, bras tendu. Perfection de l'équilibre. La soirée hier dans les anneaux. Et double tendu avec Vrille. He says it. Since high school, lived just 30 minutes from Nassau Veterans Memorial Coliseum. There's his high school coach who's lifting him up to the rings now, Kurt Friedheim. He said that Chris works down in Times Square. He works midnight to 8 as an engineer in an office building, and then he trains during the day. Go figure. Um, when does he sleep? <laughs> <laughs> Apparently never. <laughs> He's a good New Yorker. The national team coordinator for the U.S. program, Peter Corman, said yesterday in practice, Chris did a routine that could win. Look how low he is in that inverted iron cross. Nobody even dares to go that low. Unbelievable. Straight across. We're so used to seeing them so high, this almost looks strange, but it's gorgeous. The number one ringman in the world, Jordan Yapchev of Bulgaria. He trains in the United States. Not a very tall gymnast, but he's, uh, he's uh, extremely powerful. I think he's probably, in my opinion, the strongest human being on the planet, pound for pound. He really is. There's a whip it to an L cross. Look how level he wow. is. This guy, and he's so, oh my wow. gosh. L cross right to a perfectly level inverted cross, down to a Maltese cross. Oh my gosh. And look at how calm he looks. It looks like he's watching television wow. on a Barca lounger. The guy is so laid back on rings. You Look can at see the crowd oh. appreciates that. Oh, just amazing. Beautiful lines. Is that also a requirement to hit handstands? Absolutely. Has to hit those positions. He's free and clear from the straps. Getting ready for his discipline. He's got a stick. Oh, full to the back, sticks it. Beautiful. Just amazing. He had an injury in the all-around finals, and we were wondering if he was going to even be able to make it to ring finals, but he was not holding back there. Look at that. He hurt his shoulder on parallel bars in the all-around finals, but you can tell they're not hurting here. And here's his roll right into this whippet to an L-cross, and look how level he is on that L-cross. Beautiful. No, just, and there's his, his inverted cross. The amount of control and strength. Да, и 15,875. Но впереди еще два гимнаста. Да, впереди два гимнаста. Дэни Пинеро Родригес. О, какой интересный. Да, очень редкий элемент. Это самолет. Как его даже назвать-то? Передний самолет. А вот еще элемент. Из этой же серии, только согнувшись. Я вообще первый раз вижу этот Я элемент. Я тоже. Вот это та изюминка, как, которая как раз 
какой-то момент может и сыграть. А вот еще, еще раз. раз. Ну, понимаете, вот видел-то он сделал и медленно-медленно опускался. Четкости такой нет. И высокий крест. Но два элемента очень интересно. Три. Он Три. сделал два, да. Один сделал из подъема, второй просто. То есть правила это разрешают. Два баланжа и доскок. Ну и здесь как отнесутся судьи вот к, это, к, к этим его, в общем-то, таким, будем так говорить, редким элементам. Они, конечно, не новые, известные, но выполняются очень редко и требуют огромной физической силы. Я же сказал, специальной физической силы, специальной работы именно вот в этом направлении. Давайте еще раз посмотрим его элементы. Здесь все зависит сейчас от судей. Конечно, немножко чуть низковато, особенно ты руки. Да нет. Чемпионату мундиал. Трата muito conhecido do público brasileiro, ele que já veio diversas vezes treinar aqui no Brasil, fazer intercâmbios. Ficou durante um tempo punido fora das competições por doping, agora retornou em grande fase e já abre muito bem a prova nas argolas. Elemento de força e vai ali ao Cristo invertido. Duplo mortal para frente na posição grupada, carpado e o embalo à força. Também aplaudido no meio da prova, assim como o atleta da China. Ele olha ali para frente, faz um embalo, a parada de mãos, pequeno balanço dos cabos, já se aproxima da parte final da série. Sai de um duplo mortal esticado, cravado, vibra como é a ação. Atleta, assim como a Chusovitina no salto, compete há diversos anos em etapas de Copa do Mundo. Pessoal, mas... Todas as cores em mundiais, né? Sem dúvidas, tem ouro, tem prata, tem bronze e é um grande recordista. O maior medalhista nas argolas em etapas de Copa do Mundo. E o Ivan Gelder tenta mais uma nessa etapa. Mas ele ainda não sabe fazer saída, hein, Henrique? Ele faz uma saída que não cumpre com o grau de dificuldade do código. Eu já vi ele tentar sair de costas, já tentou sair de frente, se deu mal em todas elas. Aí acabou voltando para essa saída simples que ele faz, mas pelo menos não cai, né? Certamente. A pedra no sapato da prova... Do holandês, sem dúvida, é a saída. Ele, por diversos anos, foi campeão mundial, campeão de etapas de Copa do Mundo, mas sempre cometeu. Shanghai, do Yan Mingyong, Diao Huan.吊环现在是没有连接加分的后摆上成倒立